Most of us do our homework before adopting or buying animals. We learn all about their natural behaviors and traits to ensure we're fully informed about what to expect. <laughs> but animals can surprise us, and they are known to do things we didn't know were possible. From a cat comforting a dog to a horse protecting its owner, here are 20 animals who did things and melted everyone's hearts. Number 20. Puppy Copies Cockerel Dogs bark. Sometimes they also whine, yawn, and whimper. But crowing like a rooster? Well, that's something new. The owner of a Central Asian Shepherd puppy in Ukraine filmed their young pup mimicking a cockerel after it delivered its morning call. When the cockerel finished making its sound, the puppy remained seated and made a sound very similar to the cockerel, even down to the length of the call and the pitch. It was such a convincing sound that one video commenter wondered whether someone out of the camera's frame made the sound rather than the puppy. It just didn't sound real. And I get it. I mean, Central Asian Shepherds are ancient breeds popular in Russia and former Soviet countries to protect livestock from wolves. They need a strong bark, and you can pretty much guarantee that a crowing dog isn't going to stop a wolf from stealing a sheep for dinner. Before we go on, like this video, smash the subscribe button, and click the notification bell right now, or this centipede will crawl on your face when you're sleeping. Number 19. A Rooster Protects His Wife From the Rain Rainy weather can be challenging for any animal, and chickens are no different. Their feathers become soaking wet, and they aren't always able to access shelter. As they're also known to peck the ground and dig up roots, the earth often has no structure left once the rain falls, leading to a big, muddy, uncomfortable mess. So when a rooster saw that his hen was soaking wet and looking quite uncomfortable in the mud, he came to her rescue like a knight in shining armor, or more like the rooster in soaking feathers. He wandered up to her, raised his wing, and put it over the top of her to protect her from the heavy rain. It was a nice gesture caught on camera, and one that probably warmed the heart of the person who captured the footage. Although this action is actually not as rare as you might think. Roosters have a strong instinct to protect their flock, which sometimes means they can even act aggressively towards anything they believe will harm their ladies. They also rely on their wings quite a lot during mating. Roosters will court hens by dropping one wing and dancing around a hen in a circle. If the hen likes what she sees, she'll lower her back and… well, let's end the description there, shall we? Number 18. Bear Saves Crow From Drowning Vali, the brown bear from Budapest Zoo in Hungary, was busy minding his own business feasting on carrots and apples when he spotted a crow in distress. The crow had fallen into Vali's pond, and it was having a hard time getting out. In fact, without assistance, it's likely that the crow will eventually tire itself out and drown. But Vali wasn't gonna let that happen. He takes a break from his delicious snacks, ventures over to the pond, leans down, and grabs the crow by the wing. He then flops it onto dry land and goes back to eating, seemingly not giving the crow a second thought. The crow is stunned and doesn't move. It seems to want to stay around a while and gather its bearings. It's not known what happened to the crow after that encounter with Vali, but I think you can rule out Vali eating it. Some commenters speculate that Vali might have damaged its wings when it rescued the poor bird, but I like to think it made a full recovery and went on its way. According to zoo staff, Vali likely wasn't trying to be a hero. Instead, he was probably more curious about what the crow was and what it was doing flailing about in the water. They went on to say that if the crow had met the other tenant of the enclosure, a bear called Defoe, it likely would have become a quick snack. Number 17. Mama Duck Fights Crows Attacking Her Babies we often hear that there's nothing quite like a mother's love. I mean, there are stories about them lifting cars to rescue their children. As it turns out, that motherly bond and protective attribute go far beyond humans. You also see it in animals, such as ducks. A mother duck with five or so ducklings is wandering around minding her own business when a lone black crow approaches. It's clearly trying to take one of her babies, but the mother was having none of it. She keeps her babies close and gives the crow a piece of her mind. But the crow is adamant that it's not 
taking no for an answer. It keeps edging closer until it eventually slides up to one of the ducklings with a significant amount of bravado. It probably thinks it's about to score the big time, but the mother duck once again goes on the defensive and stops the crow from being able to take one of her children. The video ends once the duck is out of sight, so we don't know the outcome, but I like to think the crow had to settle for something it found already dead that day rather than a defensive baby duckling. Number 16. Cat Comforts Anxious Dog Jewel is a sweet-natured pup with one major problem. She experiences anxiety when her owners head off to work, and it's hard for her to settle herself down when her favored humans aren't around. Although Jewel's owners noticed that her anxiety was becoming less and less when they went to work, and they set up a camera to watch what she would get up to when they were away. What they saw blew their minds. They always knew that their ginger cat Kelvin and Jewel would always be in the same room together, but they never showed too much interest in each other. However, it's clear to see their relationship is a lot stronger than they made it out to be. Once their owners leave for work, Jewel will find a comfortable spot to go to sleep and Kelvin will be right behind her. He snuggles up with her, makes her feel safe, and even massages her with his paws before both of them fall asleep. And their owners are none the wiser because as soon as Jewel hears their owner's vehicle pull up, she races to the door to greet them excitedly. They would never have known that their large ginger cat was a great deal of comfort for their dog for hours every day. Number 15. Horse Comforts Emotional Owner for the longest time, animals have been a great source of comfort for people. That's why you see so many emotional support animals and those that are used for therapy. Now, you're about to find out why equine therapy is such a popular option for people needing to work on their self-confidence and emotional regulation. A woman always sets up her camera when interacting with her horses, but she captured something different than usual. The woman was going through a divorce and was in the process of moving out. She was hiding from her emotions while sitting down, but her horse, Shiner, clearly felt her pain and intense internal discomfort. Rather than going about its regular horsey business, he pulled her into his chest and provided her with a horse hug that she desperately needed. The woman said that horses could feel our emotions and are good at living in the present. She said they could take our emotions from us and let them go. The video was extremely heartwarming and many commenters said that animals are the purest creatures in the world. Before long, it had racked up over 13 million views, including 2.5 million likes on TikTok. Number 14. Clingy Orphaned Kangaroo Won't Let Rescuer Go the Kangaroo Sanctuary in Alice Springs, Central Australia is a rehabilitation paradise for baby and adult kangaroos that may not have survived without human intervention. It's generally hard to know how animals feel about being rescued, but it's pretty apparent that one kangaroo is very happy with its current situation. Kangaroo Dundee star and sanctuary proprietor Chris Barnes, known to most people as Brolka, keeps trying to walk away from a kangaroo joey, but it's showing no signs of wanting to let him go. The Roo, called Little Johansson, keeps clinging on to Brolga for dear life, almost like he doesn't want to let him out of his sight. Brolga says that he'll come back, but it doesn't make any difference. Eventually, Little Johansson does let go, but he insists on hopping along the path behind Brolga instead of carrying out normal kangaroo activities while waiting for his friend to return. Brolga says that he always makes sure Little Johansson gets plenty of cuddles, and the little guy clearly needs them. Brolga started the Kangaroo Sanctuary as the Baby Kangaroo Rescue Center in 2005 and went on to build the Kangaroo Sanctuary Alice Springs in 2011. This sanctuary now spans 100 188 acres and is dedicated to the rescue of orphaned baby roos and adult roos. Number 13. Mother Shares Bond with Gorilla Emily Austin from Jefferson, Maine was visiting Franklin Park Zoo in Austin in mid-2021 when she decided to spend some time at the gorilla enclosure where Kiki the Western Lowland Gorilla from Central Africa lives. Emily was with her five-month-old son, Canyon, and she was holding him up to the glass, talking about how cool it would be if Kiki came to see him. She didn't think she would, but Kiki, who is a mother of five, clearly shared the same maternal bond as Emily. Kiki came over to the glass and sat there staring at him lovingly for about five minutes, occasionally trying to stroke his face through the glass. 
Canyon slept through the whole experience, but it was caught on camera for the world to see. Before long, Kiki clearly felt comfortable enough with Emily and Canyon to share her own motherhood experience with them. She left Canyon's side momentarily to bring her son Pablo to see them. Pablo was born in late 2020, making him not much different in age from Canyon. The motherhood bond they shared was evident, and many people came up to Emily after the experience to say how beautiful it was. Number 12. Brown Bear Becomes Man's Best Friend We're always told that the dog is man's best friend, but could a brown bear be vying for that title? A video online went viral in 2018 of a brown bear wandering into a man's home. Rather than destroying everything in sight as a wild bear might do while looking for something to eat, it approaches a man standing in the window looking quite melancholic and stands up on two legs to embrace him in a bear hug. Like a legitimate bear hug, because well, it's a bear. The man hugs the bear back, and the bear snuggles into him as if he's his best friend. I don't know about you, but this bear is clearly not wild. It likely knows the man, because wild bears simply don't act like that. While brown bears rarely attack humans, they also usually avoid humans, not embrace them in hugs. They can also have unpredictable temperaments and will attack if they feel threatened or have been surprised. The majority of attacks by brown bears in North America are by sows with cubs. The short clip amassed thousands of views, and commenters found it incredibly heartwarming. Some speculated that it might have been taken in Russia, where there are around 100,000 brown bears. Number 11. Dog Apologizes to Dog Dogs are, without a doubt, the purest creatures on Earth. Nothing is more loving or more adorable than a sweet, sweet doggo. But if you thought your dog was the most precious, then you clearly haven't met Golden Retriever siblings Kiko and Watson from Washington State. These two sweet boys have an Instagram page for all their shenanigans, and one video went viral for all the right reasons. In the video, their owner could be heard explaining how she gave both Kiko and Watson a treat each, but Watson had eaten Kiko's as well as his own. She asked Watson what he should do after eating Kiko's Chewy, and without hesitation, he slowly walked to his brother and embraced him in a big hug. If that's not the most adorable way to apologize to your brother for eating their snack, then I don't know what is. Now, to answer the question that's likely on your mind, did Kiko get a new treat since his brother ate his? The answer is yes. Now you can sleep easy. Number 10. Horse Protects Owner it can be pretty challenging for the average person to read a horse. Unless you really know horses, their behaviors and traits aren't always easy to understand. However, one owner clearly knew their horse was protective, which is evident by the footage that they were able to capture. The owner sat on the ground, and his friend came up behind him with a big stick, pretending to hit him. Without hesitation, the horse starts sprinting in their direction, almost like it wants to stop what's about to happen. Fortunately, it was just a made-up scenario, so the man didn't get hurt, and the one with the stick was able to move out of the way. You might wonder whether horses actually form an attachment with their owners, and it's pretty hard to say. Many owners will say that they do, but studies can tell a different story. Researchers from Linköping University in Sweden wanted to know if horses could form attachment bonds and reciprocate their owner's affection, so they worked with over two dozen horses and their owners in various situations and recorded the results. They found that a horse's heart rate would rise if they were separated from a human, but nothing changed between them being separated from their owner and a complete stranger. The research showed that horses can be more relaxed around people than when they're alone, but it might not matter who the human is. Number 9. Rabbit Digs Kitten Out of Trouble Cats are curious critters that can get themselves into quite a spot of bother. I mean, how many times have you found a curious neighborhood cat trapped in your garage or lurking around one trying to get in? Pelu the kitten found himself in a similar situation, but unlike other cats, he had a rabbit friend called Chasky to help him out. Pelu became locked in a garage in Spain, and there was no way he could get out on his own. Chasky, realizing his friend was stuck, leaped into action and began frantically digging a hole in the dirt around the small shed. Before long, he had dug a cat-sized hole around the side of the garage. While stepping back to take a breather after putting in so much digging effort, 
Pelu reached a paw out before being able to break free from the garage through the hole. Pelu makes his way over to his bunny friend to thank him, and the two carry on with their day. You might not think that rabbits and cats can be friends, but just like cats and dogs, they can be. Often, you just need to introduce the two slowly and monitor their interactions. Before long, cats can get along just fine or be friends, just like Chasky and Pelu. Number 8. Lamb Needs Attention If you haven't spent much time in rural locations, you might not really know how farms work. Typically, sheep will give birth to lambs and raise them until they're old enough to head off to, well, your grocery store. While they're growing, humans don't tend to handle them too much. Instead, the lambs all frolic together in fields and entertain themselves. If a human approaches, they don't tend to want much to do with them and can even be fearful. However, that's not always the case. Sometimes sheep don't want to take on the maternal role or a lamb becomes ill and requires human intervention. They then quickly see humans as their friends or even their mothers. This lamb clearly had no concerns about humans being something to fear. As someone named Lee lies down on the grass, a needy lamb approaches and wants attention. The man pats the lamb and gives it plenty of scratches, and when he stops, the lamb hits him with his hoof, almost like it's telling him not to stop. While all the lamb's friends are busy frolicking and playing together, this one just wants to spend time with its human. Think of that the next time you tuck into a lamb rack for dinner, I dare you. Number 7. A Chicken Adopts a Kitten Chickens never seem all that maternal. They spend a lot of their time pecking in the dirt, having dust baths, and eating grain. But if you've owned chickens, then you know that can all change. They can become broody, and you run the risk of losing your hands if you dare try to lift them off the eggs they're trying to keep warm, even if those eggs will never hatch chicks. But as it turns out, they don't even need to be sitting on eggs or chicks to be broody. They can be sitting on kittens. One chicken owner filmed themselves trying to move a chicken off the chicks it was sitting on. The hen wasn't sitting on chicks. It had about four young kittens in its nesting box, keeping them safe and warm. The chicken wasn't about to let the owner take her babies away, so she quickly rearranged herself on top of the kittens. Well, at least you know those kittens won't grow up into cats that'll kill chickens, as many others do. Number 6. Osiris and Riff Rat Two of the last domestic pets you expect to get along well are rats and dogs, but Osiris and Riff Rat are the exception to the rule. Osiris is a three-year-old Dutch Shepherd trained as a therapy dog that the owners rescued as a puppy when he was abandoned in a parking lot. Over the years, he has been a form of support for many foster animals his owners have had in their care, and he has been trained to be incredibly gentle with small animals. But more recently, Osiris formed a beautiful friendship with a three-week-old rat called Riff Rat. Osiris is owners rescued the rat from a pet store specializing in reptiles. He was destined to become another creature's lunch, and they decided to take him home. Now, at first, Osiris's owners were dubious about introducing the rat to Osiris, but they quickly realized they had nothing to worry about. Just a few months later, the pair are inseparable. They spend a lot of time playing and sleeping together, and the rat clearly trusts Osiris a lot, since he'll often stick his head inside Osiris's mouth and clean his teeth. In return, Osiris will groom Riff Rat by licking him. Riff Rat also has another rat friend called Millhouse, but it's clear to see that he prefers the company of Osiris. Number 5. Stray Dog Helps Children Cross the Street Busy streets are no place for children, but they often need to get from one side of a busy street to the other to get to school and kindergarten. The problem is, in some places, vehicles aren't willing to stop or even slow down to let children cross. One dog took it upon himself to make sure children were able to cross the road safely in the city of Batumi in Georgia. The stray dog is known as Kupata, but is also referred to in some news stories as Kersha. He spends most days at a busy intersection standing in front of vehicles barking, which makes them slow down, stop, and and allow the children to pass. He will then continue barking before walking alongside the children, making sure they can make it safely across the road. Kupata has now been videoed so many times doing his essential job that he is an internet sensation. He put the city of Batumi on the map, bringing tourists in from far and wide, and the Georgia Tourism Board even adopted him as the city's de facto mascot. He made such a difference to the community that a mural has now been put up in his honor. Number 4. 
Dachshund and Lion Best Friends Double amputee zookeeper John Rake shares a special bond with a 500-pound male lion, Bone Digger, who he hand-reared from a cub. But their bond is nowhere near as special as the bond Bone Digger has with his best friend, an 8-year-old dachshund called Milo. The pair both live at GW Exotic Animal Park in Wynwood, Oklahoma, and they are inseparable. Bone Digger was born with a metabolic bone disorder that has left him mildly crippled. When Milo and two other dachshunds, Angel and Bullet, sensed that there was something wrong with the lion when he was young, they tried to protect him. And now they have an incredibly unlikely friendship. The dogs play with Bone Digger, feast on raw meat with him, and even play on the grounds together. Milo even tries to copy how Bone Digger interacts with other lions at the park. Every time they have to be separated, such as when the enclosure is being cleaned, they all greet each other like long-lost lovers once they are reunited. Milo and Bone Digger were introduced at a young age of around eight or nine weeks, which meant the relationship could naturally blossom. Bone Digger tends to be aggressive with anyone other than John and the Dachshunds. Number 3. Cat Gives High Fives at the Gym Working out at the gym can be hard work, and sometimes you want someone there cheering you on and giving you a high five for your efforts. Well, if you go to a specific CrossFit gym in Hohat City, Inner Mongolia, Northern China, there won't be a human giving you a high five, there'll be a cat. A cat that used to be a stray before it was adopted spends a lot of time hanging out at the gym and will give anyone a high five that walks past. Often, people will line up just to give the cat a high five, even if some of them are left hanging. Clearly, the cat has its favorites. The cat's owner said that the cat would often follow people into the gym and take a seat to watch everyone go about their business. I don't know about you, but I would definitely have more motivation to head to the gym if I knew I was going to be cheered on by a cat. It's not known why the cat chooses to go to a gym rather than hang out at its house, but it's clearly a real people cat and enjoys getting as much attention as possible. Number 2. Dog Protects Girl From Mother's Scolding Toddlers seem to get into everything. It takes them just seconds to turn your house into a war zone after you've just spent several hours cleaning it. Yu Yu from the eastern Chinese city of Shuzhou is a typical toddler. Her mother, Miss Sun, had just purchased facial cream and, after leaving it unattended, came back to find that Yu Yu had ripped open the packaging and used at least half of the tub by playing with it. Miss Sun was quite upset and started shouting at Yu Yu. Their golden retriever, Harry, named after Harry Potter from the J.K. Rowling series, shares a close bond with Yu Yu and acted in the most heartwarming way. She started to use her body as a physical barrier between Yu Yu and Miss Sun, even going so far as to bare her teeth at Miss Sun. Harry became even more defensive when she tried to get him to move out of the way so she could scold her daughter. Once Miss Sun had stopped scolding the toddler, Harry started comforting Yu Yu by wrapping her paws around her and snuggling her head into the girl's shoulder. Miss Sun decided to film the event because she found it both infuriating and funny at the same time. She also wanted to capture as much footage of Harry as possible since he was getting older and wouldn't be around forever. Number 1. Orangutan Saves Chick From Drowning a moorhen chick got itself into a spot of bother at Dublin Zoo in Ireland. It fell into the water in the Bornean orangutan enclosure, and there's a chance it would have drowned without intervention. But not to worry, because Jurong, the Bornean orangutan, wasn't gonna let that happen. Now, at first, he offers the chick some food because, well, that's what a good host does when someone visits your home, right? But then he quickly realizes that the chick is actually in trouble. So without hesitation, Jurong picks up the chick and puts him on the bank. He then blows on him and picks him up to inspect him. Zoo visitors are concerned that Jurong will eat the chick, but he's genuinely just curious. He keeps picking him up and putting him down again while gently patting the chick's feathers. A Dublin Zoo spokesperson said Jurong has a lovely nature and is both gentle and inquisitive. He was born at Chester Zoo in Britain and has been in Dublin since 1996, where he's lived at both Dudley Zoo and Dublin Zoo. So far, Jurong has fathered one female orangutan called Majur, who still lives at Dublin Zoo. It just goes to show that you never quite know everything about an animal, and there's more to them than what you read in a book. Has your pet ever done anything out of the ordinary? We'd love to read your stories in the comments. Also, check out our other cool stuff showing up on screen right now. See you next time!